Now your certified storm ready forecast from NBC 25. Well, it was a great late April day today. Maybe you went outside and did a little bit of yard work because it was beautiful earlier, but now we have some changes, a little bit of cloud cover and some showers moving on through parts of the area. This is a live look at downtown Saginaw where it is cloudy and looking at the pavement there, it doesn't look like a whole lot of rain is falling or has fallen, but we still do have as we take a look at the satellite radar composite, a few very light rain showers moving through the area. It looks like the west side of town in Saginaw getting hit with some sprinkles to light showers as well as just to the north of Flint, maybe around Flushing, Clio, Mount Morris, a few showers falling back into Shiawassee County too, and Gratiot County getting what looks like the heaviest rain right now, even a little bit of a little bit of yellow off to the southwest of Elma, indicating that the rain could be moderate at times there. But overall, this rain not going to amount to much at all. Breezy with a few showers tonight into tomorrow, but the main story tomorrow will be the cooler temperatures. We'll warm back up again, though, as we head into Friday and dry out this weekend. Looking decent, can't completely rule out a little bit of rain, but overall it looks like a pretty nice forecast. This is Futurecast at 8 p.m. tonight. It's not picking up on the rain that's coming through. Obviously, there will be a little bit. You saw that on the radar, but it doesn't look heavy. As we head into your Thursday, our model keeping the rain primarily to the south of us, but there still is a chance that the shower activity will back up a little bit further to the north and west than what our model is showing here. Now, as we advance the clock into your Friday morning, you can see that we start to clear out some. We start out mostly sunny at 730 in the morning. Then as we advance the clock into the afternoon, perhaps a few fair weather clouds, probably not this robust though. It looks like still a good amount of sunshine to end that work week. This is what we're looking at in terms of rainfall. According to our model, nothing measurable. We will have a few hundreds, I think, but this is just giving you an indication that what is coming through is pretty paltry. For tonight, a few hit and miss showers, 40 degrees, and the shower activity mainly before midnight. Tomorrow, a few off and on rain showers possible, but 56 degrees. The cooler temperatures by far will be the bigger story tomorrow, and it will be breezy with north winds at 8 to 18, gusting to 27 miles an hour. But that day tomorrow doesn't last. We're looking at a return to the spring-like conditions on Friday with a high of 66, lots of sunshine. Then almost summer-like through the weekend into early next week, a passing stray shower or two possible Saturday or Sunday. The, but the far bigger story will be the warmer temperatures, highs, low 70s, lows at night in the 50s. Our next chance of rain coming in, or good chance of rain, that is, on Monday. Bill.